afternoon, good evening, friends and colleagues. My name is Siri. Today I'd like to show you how to install the version 10.1.18 for QA so you could run it for Sun 6.2 in your version using the data link 5 and 6 and the data link 6. To do so, let's open Windows Explorer then from that window let's go into the C drive and see that folder called Santla 62 which is the extraction of the file which is the installer for Sun 62 you received from Sun Plus. From this file which is a folder you just double click onto it and you can find the installer for the QA. What I have here is 10.1.18 version, which is now the current version that is by default released with our installer. So we just double click onto that folder. Into that folder, before we install that file, we have to do so, first of all something. We need to find that con, con details.txt. Con details uh, inside of that con details txt, you can find uh, some of the parameters that is used by QNDA when it is installed. As you can see, it is asking you for the data link 4, would you like to install it? The response is no and no, which means that when we install the installer, it won't install the version 4. Then for the 5, it is telling also no and no. And then for the 6, it says yes and yes. So if we want to have that SS5 and 6 version uh, for the data link, we need to change this no to yes and yes. Then after we did that change, then we just save the file. Save it. Then we exit. After that, you can double click on Setup Now. From the Setup file, welcome to the Install Shield Resort for Info QA and Query and Analysis. We need to click on Next to install it. We do not change the folder for the installation for QA so we click on next we leave empty also that QA service location then we leave it complete as it is and then next at the end when we are ready for installing the program we just click on install then we wait for another wizard within that installation to launch so we can set the connection between it and the database. Now this, this other wizard is lodged. Here we have the query and analysis to set, Sun System 5 and 6 to set, and Sun System 6. So let's begin with query and analysis. Then we select it. We click on next then we leave Microsoft SQL okay and then as the database type we click on next then the data source name is a11111 here for me and the database is Sun Sun systems data Okay, then we click on next, 
then I prefer to use Windows Authentication. Okay, then I click on Next, then I click on Test Connection to see if it is connected. Now the connection test was sex successful. We click on OK and we click on Finish. Then we go for this to set the Sun System 5 and 6. Then next, uh, still enabled, then uh, the database type is Microsoft SQL. We click on Next, then the database source name is A. 11111 okay then this database name is sun systems domain okay then we click on next then i always choose authentication for windows then i click on next i click on next and text test the connection and okay then i finish then I do the last one for 6. Next, I leave Microsoft SQL enabled. Then next, then I choose this one always to be A1111 with one five ones. Then Sun System, Sun Systems Domain. Okay, then I click on next. Then Windows authentication, then next, then next, and I test the connection, it was successful, I finish, and then at the end when I finished all the free products, then I click on finish. Now, normally I should see all these uh, icons to be green, otherwise I have some issues with my connections if you want also you can change it from here and then you click on test connection depending on your need you can ever change it by using your sql server access using the sa uh, account or you use your windows authentication for your user account now as i finished it now i can click on save then to finish the wizard for the install of info query and analysis i click on finish to check if i i i, I did well the installation i can close this one and then i can click on uh, the start button and search here for executive okay which is here i have it already here so from this executive i click and then i run it i uh, i pin for the start on the start um tile and then i can open it from there or i open in a new window then i have it like this so now if i well installed all the data links i need to see uh i should see the query and analysis sun system 5 and 6 and sun system 6 just here you can see which versions have you installed 20.001 here for here you have 30.001 and here you have 10.1.6 which is for q and a now i will use that user id zc1 to enter into the system now it is compiling and extracting to accessing the database uh, now let let us try to see if uh, uh, sun sun uh, ss connect uh, what is it this data link 5 and 6 is working to do so i just select that uh, that cell i right click and define a criteria from this criteria i select the data type 
to be summary link from that summary link this is the error I, I, I received when I try to access for 5 and 6 as you can see let me cancel this one and then redo it again so you can see that error summary link then when I select you see that the SS5 and 6 disappeared so it is only the query and analysis here and the SS6 that is the issue that we are uh, encountering now so how to solve the issue so we could see also the sound system 5 and 6 onto this data link I cancel it I close this window then I go onto C drive and uh, I can download this file you see this file Q&A uh, dash data link dash 20.001.0019.zip I've shared it just in the place where this video is recorded so you can download from that one then you right click on it and then you extract it okay so let's extract it like right click winner and then extract to q and a data link and this will be the name of the folder now i finished it then you can see that there is that ls alchemy inside of that folder that is the folder we will ask the system to search when we would like to update the data link so now when, once it is extracted let's go again into the start button uh, start menu okay then click on this search uh, button and search for update okay what i need is this update data link so i right click on it and run it as an administrator then I, what i need to do is to click on this is the, uh, the kind of window that is to update uh, used for updating data link from that this is the place where the system is searching where you would like to update the data link so i click onto this assist button then i make the system to search onto this folder so what i should do is i just come back onto the c drive then i go into the sun plus 62 then i point onto the q and a data link 20.0010019 and i click on ok once it is ok i can check now the sun system 5 and 6 when i check for six it says that it is not available it's normal because that data link is only containing the, the, the data link for five and six so we click on ok what we would like only to update is the sun system five and six ss5 when once i finish that one i've chosen the, the place or the path where the data link exists then i click now i checked that sun system 5 and 6 and i click on update then it asks you start installation yes say yes then operation complete i click on ok then once it is finished let's go back again to see if it is working let's run now executive ever you can search for executive here okay executive then i open it i open it from a new window then as i can see always now 
the data link is still 001 then let's use that ZC1 to enter I click on OK it is still uh, initiating the database then now let's redo again what we did last time right click define criteria then from this way I choose to use summary link this time there was no error and when I double click when I click on this assist button you can see now query and analysis sun system 5 and 6 and sun system 6 all together but to let you know that this one is now working for both of them let me choose that sun system 5 and 6 here okay then the business unit I am use, using is ATA which is Adventist test business unit okay when you have this error just ignore it check do not show this message again and continue then the table I will choose I click on the assist button and LA for ledger okay then ledger will be A account code let me pick all the one anything that is beginning with one so anything that is beginning with one when I click on this assist button it will retrieve anything that is beginning with one the same also if I want for example for anything beginning with 19 then you will see that it will only pick the 19 that is the reason of this percentage so we just want anything beginning with one then the period let's pick anything because our church began on 1944 October then there should no uh, be no transaction before that day then the filter will be 2015 012 which is the end of the, of the last year let's pick the account code I just drag it like that uh, sorry let's delete it because this is a summary link I just need the base amount so I will drag this one and click on OK. OK. So as you see, I am using Sun System 5 and 6 for this one. Then let me redo the same. OK. Let me redo the same. Then right click, define criteria. Then from data type, type let's choose summary link but this time instead of using sun system 5 and 6 let's choose sun system 6 only because if you are on 6 2 you're able to do that then the business unit will still be ata then the table will be la the ledger will still be a and account code will always be anything beginning with one so it will be uh, retrieving all the short-term assets as we can know it then the accounting period we will always use 1844-010 then 2015-012 then let's choose the base amount we double click on it and click on OK so if we uh, see it now you can see that this one is using Sun 6 system 6 and the previous one is using Sun system 5 and 6 so to define them let me choose put it here 5 SS 5 and 6 and here SS 6 only okay so you can see the difference between them when it is extracted okay now let's extract the, the transaction the extract 
I'm going to click on extract primary worksheet. As you see, both of them are extracting correctly the thing. If we would like to drill it down now, let's specify. Then I would like to drill it by account and then the account description. As it is said, LA is for uh, chart of account and LA is uh, LA is for ledger account code and ledger chart of account description. I click on OK and then this is the amount inside of the system. Let me right click and rename it SSS5 and 6. Then now let's come back at the root of the parent sheet now and extract the drill path for the 6th version now. We click on account code, then I choose chart of account description also and click on OK to extract it. Then I rename it as SS6 to see. As you can see, there is no difference between them. So now I can run it. But uh, to prove to you that you can even run the financial statements, you can let me show to you that you go into the uh, document. Let me run the financial statements. Don't uh, just ignore this long path I am using here. Okay, so this is the latest file for the financial statements. I double click on it and right away it is retrieved here and because ADV is not existing onto this file onto this uh, server I will still use keep using ATA as the business unit I click on OK I extract it now uh, OK extract it and let's see if it is working now As you can see, we will try also to, to test what we uh, have seen here into Excel to see how it works. But meanwhile, let's wait for the financial statements to run. Okay, it is finishing. As you see, Everything is extracted nicely. We didn't add even to convert the fi financial statements into six version. We just updated the data link and it has loaded and extracted correctly the financial statements. Now let's close everything. Close all. I don't save anything. It was just for your to prove to you that the data link is working now. Now let's open Excel 2013. From Excel 2013 I open new worksheet. Then I will use, uh, I enter into info and and logon and I will still use ZC1 as the user logon. From there, I click on A1 where I want the first query to be loaded. Uh, so, so I click on summary report right away. From summary report, this issue is still there, but just ignore it. Do not show this message again and continue. Then the business unit will be ATA, the table of the table from table to click on the assist button will be LA ledger will still extract for one percent from here for the account code and the period will be still 1844 010 to 2015 then I need the account code the description for the chart of account and the base amount 
this is using the version 6 as you can see so when I extract it you see it was 11 million 020,792.44 so let me rename this file ss6 okay then let me open a new uh, worksheet add a new worksheet then summary report but this time the product will be sun system 5 and 6 I will keep the business unit the table will be LA account code will always begin with 1 and the period will be 1844 sorry okay sorry okay so period will be 1844.001010 and then 2015.012 then I click on account code I expand this plus to open the chat of account I click double click and description then I collapse that part and click on paste amount and I click on ok now as you can see the amount is still 11 million zero twenty thousand seven hundred and ninety two point forty four so this is using SS5 and six so now you do not need ever to convert it but just to update the data link the data link using this file as i explained to you sun plus six two which is Q and a data link 20.01.0019.zip so that is my presentation i wish it will help you to improve your experience with something okay see you next time